And welcome to another Garish Mod Build Request. So, today, I have been looking at the comments, and a lot of comments were dropped last time. It's really awesome. I'm really glad you guys are engaging in this series, so that's why I'm going to keep it on going. So, the one that has, or had, well, it still has, the most up likes was, um, for me to build a working motor, or motor, or... Artillery for, of some sort and that is what I am going to try to do so I have an idea and uh, Let's just go ahead and try it try it out. Um Okay, let's get started. So I was thinking there's these tubes here uh, Oh, yeah, that's good and as our explosives I'll use barrels and let's see if they will fit in here. This will be our ammunition. Yeah. Oh, man. That's nice Okay, good so, we will, um, oh god, like that, let's just put it like that, okay, good. And so what we will need is some sort of plate to be at the bottom. So for this to work, I will use wire forcer to push it out of the, uh, of the tube. And to make it, make it ex explode, we're gonna have a little, uh, time or fuse delay. Um, cause the barrel, obviously, I'm gonna ignite it. Why is this being so weird? There we go. Okay, because I'm in, I'm going to ignite it. Okay, let's see. Um, let's go for wire forcer. Okay. So. Okay, I'm. I'll. I'll think about how how advanced I want this to be. Because right now I'm just gonna put a standard, a standard firing range on it, and it's force distance. It's not gonna be that far. How far is this? Ah, perfect! Look at that! I've probably done this before. <laughs> uh, force multiply 5,000. That seems about it. It's about good. Okay, it's gonna lay in the bottom, so I'll probably just do like that. A wire forcer. And I want an igniter, if that exists. It does! Nice. Max range? That's not gonna be that much. Uh, let's say 25, because I don't want it... Because I don't want it to ignite my, uh, my mo- my- my motor. Motor. Or artillery. There we go. Okay. So we're gonna need a button to activate all of this. Why is that so weird? That's weird. Okay. Let's, um... Oh yeah, fire. That's bad. That's right. Okay, let's make a little control panel, shall we? Okay, we have welded these together, haven't we? Yeah, we have. Um... So let's make a... There we go, like a plate. And on it, um, yeah, sure, it works fine. And on it is going to be like that. That's that's a motor. Mo motor. I don't know how to pronounce it. Motor. I'm gonna pronounce it motor for now. From now on. Yep, that's what I want. And let's. Isn't there a four by four? That would make sense, wouldn't it? <laughs> I just had it. Okay, let's just um go down the barrel. There we go. Let's see how this works. Fire. Okay, so it could all it could probably use a little more force, but it works. And I'm also going to wire up my. Is that an extinguish length? Ex I just want a <laughs> out. Okay, so now it should be able to fire. So. Ah, this is actually quite genius. So the longer I hold fire down, the longer it will shoot. Ah, look at that. Ah, <laughs> that worked quite well. So what I thought was really cool last time uh, in the video that you guys enjoyed it and you guys thought that I did a good job and everything. So uh, I'm definitely going to keep up with this series because I think it's so cool that you guys can just... Uh... Is this shit still welded? No, it's not. Um, because I think it... I think it's so cool that you guys can request something and see what I get out of it. I like that you guys like it, if you know what I mean. Um, so I'm gonna keep it up. Definitely. Because this is gonna be an easy way for me to adjust the fire on this thing. So let's, uh, reload it. Into the barrel. Actually, maybe if I... 
Not resize it. There's something that can make it super slippery. Magnetize? Is that it? No. Knack. <laughs> what am I thinking? Physical properties. Ice. That's what. That's what I want. Yeah, so now it's drifting around in there. That's good. Fire. And bam. Okay, let's um let's weld up the rest of this machine. And I'm going to put it down here. Boop. Okay. And then let's aim it. Okay, I'm going to make a prop spawner in there because it it annoys me that I can't <laughs> that I have to reload it all the time. Let's put it in there. And Oh no 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 no. Just like that. I'm going to weld Oh no, I have to, uh, spawn, spawner. I love the new search thing they did. Automatic undo. I don't want it to undo anytime soon. If it doesn't explode, it will be nice to have it undone after 25 seconds, I guess. Wire. Okay, let's wire this bad boy up. I want you to spawn. On out. Okay. Right. And there we go. So let's aim it up. Arm it. Ah! Uh. <laughs> Oopsie. I should have thought of that. Let's uh, make you no collide everything. Let's go again. It's armed. Fire! We have issues. Ah, man. Oh, well, it's gonna delete itself anyway. We had we, we we made a big bummer guys. Or I did you didn't okay good. So let's arm it and fire What it it, it, it it did fire But it didn't get ignited for some reason Why does this not work I am curious to see Okay, let's see how let's see what happens it spawns. It didn't activate the second one. Nothing happened. There we go. Let's see what happens now. It spawns. Fire. Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! Okay. Now, everything is cool. Shit. Because I wanted to... I mean, that was a stupid brain chat. Oh, this is not. Okay, I should. Okay. Let's arm it again. Yes! Yes! Ah, oh, yeah! We got a working artillery! Okay, let's, um. Let's make some citizens and see if we can kill them. No, not citizens. Let's, uh. Yeah, citizens. I like killing citizens. Okay, we've got four citizens right there. So let's. Find our aim. Fire! Oh, direct impact. Damn. Okay, so in order to make it... I'm... I don't, I don't really know what makes it fire shorter. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one! They even duck! They even duck! Ah! It's so cool! But it's quite hard to aim. Oh, look at that. Woo! Incoming! Oh, yeah! All right! That was quite awesome. Nice request. I love it. So, now you guys also know how to build a, a artillery piece in wire. So, I hope you guys enjoy. Please go ahead and leave some feedback on this video. It always helps me because, obviously, you guys are watching. So, I mean, you guys are the ones being entertained here. And um, go ahead and leave some other uh, requests. And if you see something you like, go ahead and like that comment. So they, that way I see uh, what you like, um, what you guys want me to build. Without further ado, thank you guys for watching. And we will see you in the next video.